Hey everyone, Zach here, and today we're going to be drawing a Chonky Greymon with Posca Pens to celebrate DigiJuly. I'm going to walk you through the materials that I use as well as the process, so without further ado, let's get this party started. Alright, so we started by sketching a whole bunch of different Digimon, and after reviewing them, I decided to land on Greymon. He just seemed the most dynamic of the bunch. We'll be painting him on a tiny black canvas that's roughly about 3 inches by 3 inches. We'll use some washi tape to secure the canvas to the table. We'll use a white Prismacolor color erase pencil to sketch him on the canvas. And of course we've got our Posca pens to color this piece in. Now these are the bullet shaped ones so they've got a bit of a sharper point to them which is going to make getting those small details a lot easier. And of course I'll be posting links to all the products mentioned in the description below. So first I'm going to tape the canvas onto the surface so that it doesn't move about. And now that the canvas is secure, I can begin sketching. Alright, so now that we've got the sketch done, I'm going to take my kneaded eraser and just clean it up a bit to prepare it for painting. Now we're going to take our Posca pen, and since it's new, I do have to break it in, and I'll do that by taking the lid off, pressing it down, giving it a good shake to loosen up that ink, and let's test it on the side here to see if it's flowing well. It is, so now we can get started. Now that we've got the base colors, it's safe to go in and add some more details by outlining him. So I'm going to use that same blue that I used for the top of his head to just give it a little bit more detail. And after a few minor corrections, I'm going to go in and give him a white outline to help separate him from that dark background, especially since the top of his head is that dark blue and it kind of blends in together.
Okay, now I'm gonna go in and clean this up a bit and sharpen those edges. And yeah, I think we're ready to sign this and check out the finished piece. Thank you so much for watching this video. Again, I've listed all the supplies used in this project in the description below. If you liked what you saw, feel free to hit that subscribe button and ring that bell for notifications for future videos like this. Be sure to check out my other social media channels as well for even more art. And until next time, I'm Zach, and remember, Digimon are the champions.